got gas. But driving around looking for gas is what made us not have gas. Today, I was trying to handle some business for work and um, I decided I wanted to go get some Mexican food because it's Taco Tuesday. And then, you know, everybody been cutting up y'all because we got a gas shortage. We got chicken shortage. The popo where we live, apparently, like, they not working. Like, they shut down our call. 911 center has been directed to Raleigh instead of Durham. Um and line. yeah the line the line y'all this gas. this is the line for gas it's way better like, it's way better I don't even know if y'all can see but that's the line for gas like it's not really I mean I guess it's that serious was not y'all making it that serious by like running to the gas station like just get a little bit so that you go on and go back home especially if you don't work for, why you got a left turn signal on but you move right. Anyway, so we're going to this place called Queso Monster, and they food looks so good on their Facebook and Instagram pictures, and it's Taco Tuesday, so I don't know if I want to get tacos or if I actually want to get like a quesadilla or something like that, but we hungry, so it's just going to be a ride along. We're going to take y'all with us so we can get this, um, these tacos and stuff. Also, um, y'all be on the lookout because I will be posting a blog about my trip to Miami, Florida for my birthday. Um, so y'all can see about that. But until then, like, I'm just trying to get set up back into life being back home before I start editing all photos and stuff. But yeah, y'all, why we got a shortage? You ran that red light. Stay safe in these streets. I'm going on. Anyway, why is it a shortage on everything? Like, why? Sorry for the rockiness, y'all. Why is everything a shortage? Like, before you know, it's gonna be back to a shortage. Toilet tissue, paper towels, sanitizer. Like, I don't understand. And I'm not even gonna go back. Was Lysol wipes and Clorox wipes already five dollars? They was all always they was five dollars. Well, now they five ninety four, five ninety nine or something. I can okay. So really gonna be on the right hand side, just to let you know. Um, like everything is just. It's a lot going on in the world, so I don't know how I feel. Oops, there's a gas station with, with a little line, so I'm gonna stop. Uh, okay. Yeah. Oh, all right, y'all, so. You go your nose, though. I just pulled my nose ring out. I'm not picking my nose, girl. Anyway, so we're gonna let y'all know. Oh, there go Quesarita, look, look at them. So you going to the gas right, station right, or the Quesarita? I'm going to okay, the this. Curve. Oh, ain't no line. Look at the queso monster, y'all. Ain't no line over there. Yay. So, hopefully, they food be good. Okay. Gas is $2,089. $3? Never. Anyway, y'all, I'm going Well, at least we don't live in California where it's $4. Whew. This lady can dry. Look, she impatient. I got this. Pulling up. Okay, we're going to watch the truck now. dollars and 49 cent worth of gas that's 89 gallons like was it a truck did they fill it up with two containers like <laughs> shut your mouth and call it a day how the hell <laughs> yo okay that gas pump say ain't got no gas regular only oh it say regular oh no it's got plastic bag on it so ain't no gas I should have known it was only diesel was gas is available at this gas station, so look, they can only get three dollars thirty-three. Oh, cents. also, what well, I heard on Facebook, they were saying that the gas state, the BPs on Roxborough Road, still had gas. We is on Miami though, boo. Oh, all right. A few moments later. So we got our food. Um, so we got these little drinks. This is mine. Got a strawberry lemonade. 
And my mom got a what berry? Uh, berry explosion. Berry, berry explosion. So she has blueberry, pomegranate, raspberry, strawberry, and then with a lemonade. Oh, and blackberry. Um, and then we got our we got some elotes. Okay, hold on, y'all, cause it's about to try and get into this without dropping it. Jesus. Oh. My mom did not get the chili powder on there because she don't like spicy stuff. I don't like spicy stuff either, but I've had elotes before, and the combination to me is great. Um, now my mom said. She didn't quite like it. She said it was kind of plain, like eating regular corn. Yeah. So hopefully that's not how I feel. And then they put all our food in these little bags like this. Like, they pretty heavy. So apparently, oh, that's a big, that's a big container. Appa apparently, so I got a case of Berea. My mom and my sister got nachos. My mom got veggie nachos. My sister got shrimp nachos. Um, all quesadillas, I think, come with chips and queso, which I love to pay one price for chips, queso, and a burrito. Who don't like to do that? Anyway, that's exciting. So um, I'm about to just try to sit this camera down somewhere so I can show y'all my reaction to this elote. Okay, finna dive into this sucker. First of all, smell taste because I always smell my food. Uh -oh. Second of all, here we go. Yeah, that's different. Hmm. So, oh, oh, lower. Hmm. What is missing? Like a little salt? That's I don't weird. know. But yeah, this just tastes like mayonnaise on a stick. Yeah, we do better at home. Okay, so, um,. And it was weird because I was recording and I was trying, I originally recorded him making our drink and I was trying to record him making our elotes because I've seen people where they dip stuff in a container and then they, you know, brush the phone, sprinkle, stuff like that. And he came to me, he was like, oh, like, um, we don't want you recording. Like I like my customers and basically saying like it was top secret. But I was just only trying to record the man, not the recipe, but. Anyway, you won't miss something. Do not record, because they won't I do. still could have recorded. But anyway, this thing was $5. So, I'm still going to eat it. So, what yours says? Mine just says like I had corn with. And this is not spicy. You could have got this on there, and it still would have tasted like corn. Oh, yeah. Mine just tastes like corn with um, Parmesan cheese on it. Stuff sprinkled on it. Yeah. Maybe that's what it is. Maybe it's the cheese. They ain't used the right kind. Anyway. I'm going to still eat it. Yeah. But it's not like, oh, my God, it's set out for. Um, anyway, you like a drink. Ooh. Oh, it must be tart. It's just as tart. I mean, said, well, it's good. It's good. I can taste the pomegranate more than I can taste anything. It looks delicious. And the way he was mixing it together. Yeah, the pomegranate really comes through on this. It's good. Great. You want to taste? No, you just came from my time. You just not finished quarantine. And yep, we in the car together. Oh no, I'm glad. Anyway, that hold this, friends. hold this. Anyway, <laughs> the air is going outside. I'm just not sick. And here comes my food. Oh, that look good. Oh, let me try one of those chips. No, cause you got chips in your own bag. Oh, I do. This is my plate, y'all. Ooh. That look good, and it come with the little burrito stuff, y'all. Anyway, oh, don't fall now. I mean, they ain't give me a lot of queso, but anyway, everybody love a good. Who shush while they eating chips? Nobody. 
Nobody. It's a uh, that way give it a crunch. Girl, I thought we were hungry. I what am that? hungry, but guess what? Oh my! I'll yeah. be back. Yeah. Mhm. Mm Yo, I had to move the camera because my mama needed her food, but oh my god, her food looks so good. Look at, look at that. Back it up. Back it up. Look at that. Open it. Open it. She don't want to eat it in the car because she said it's a lot. Oh my God. I should have got that. She lied. The pictures do not lie, y'all. The pictures do not lie. That's one thing I can't say. Her food look just like the picture I saw on Instagram. So if you... Keep talking. So if you order the nachos, I highly recommend. Girl, you're not going to be able to oh, eat all that. Too top, man. Look. You're not gonna be able to eat all that. You just should shell. Well, you can shell when you're home. You gotta eat it right now. I'm not gonna drop your food. Please don't. Look at her food, y'all. Look at all of that in that container. Shell. Yours not as hot as mine, but it look good. Look, guacamole. Oh, y'all. I put my sister don't like guacamole, and I, I said put her guacamole on the side. I'm finna tear this guacamole up. Anyway, my little chips was good, so let me just try to do this case of real. Mm -mm. I can hold your camera in a minute. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait. Uh, I guess that's the reason for me having So we thought we was being smart by coming to this gas station because there was no cars out here. And, um, uh, <laughs> that's why they, know they don't got no gas. They got handwritten signs that say no gas. The machine was cutting up because at first I thought it was 279, then it flipped to 289. And we thought by driving out here by the airport, it was gonna be gas, but no. no. It didn't work. So, um. I know. I know. <laughs> Where we going now? I'm going to the airport. They're gonna fill me up. So, my car gonna be. You do not have no airport car. I'll uh -huh. be asking them for it's, no. It's a button right here. Say airport mode. Airplane. No. So we're driving around town looking for um gas. Her uh -huh. light just came on. Oh, that was too much of my face. No, it's not too much. We had gas. But driving around looking for gas <laughs> is what made us not have gas. Uh -huh. So if you short on gas, don't drive around looking for gas. Get you an app or something to tell you who got gas, who don't got gas. Use your social media. You can take this and take um Aviation Parkway. So yeah, way. right, all the way right. Anyway, um, don't drive around your out your gas looking for gas. Get you an app to tell you who got gas. No, uh, -uh. the app is oh, the app you how much is price of the gas. It's not you told you. me it said. I'm telling you, I know that's what they said, but it's not working. Okay, so Gas Buddy was supposed to say that they was updating their app to tell you who had gas, but they have not done so. So now it's just how much gas is. We just passed pass a place in North Carolina. This may be normal for some of y'all who not in North Carolina. But $2.99 is a lot for some gas around here. So, especially the how long this short is supposed to last? I heard they was hiring truck drivers for $14,000 a week. We need to go get our CDLs oh, and learn okay. real quick. Yeah, because the lady said the day once we was out, it was going to take the gas stations about five days to get more gas. She said yeah. that. Yeah. Five days without gas. So y'all better get your bicycles, get your money for the scooters, start, get your walking shoes. Because eventually if we run out of gas, the bus is going to run out of gas too, y'all. So. But hey, if y'all find some gas, don't buy $269 worth of gas. Yeah, don't buy $269 worth of gas. Leave some for the other American citizens out here who didn't make it to the gas station. We this light is just, bothering me like the sun that keeps flashing. We literally just seen somebody pay two, buy $269 worth of gas. And that wasn't cute, y'all, because we couldn't even get no gas because they bought $269 worth of gas. Hey, oh, look at the line for the airport. Oh. So... I can't even turn properly. It's a pandemic. On gas. That's sad. Everywhere. No gas, no chicken. No. So, y'all. Memorial Day weekend. From on the upset. Yeah. Who going somewhere for Memorial Day weekend? Everybody going to be in the house now being cheap. Like, oh, ain't no gas, y'all. So, we ain't going nowhere. So, that means it's about to be a bunch of cookouts. So, 
Well, we ain't gonna have no fried chicken. You ain't got no chicken. I just know that I don't want to keep driving around for gas. So anyway, look at the coincidences. The world opened up for us to go somewhere. And then they ran out of chicken because everybody's trying to go get chicken, Bojangas, um, Popeyes. Um, and now we don't have no gas, so we can't even travel. We can't even get to the airport to get flewed out. I guess y'all should have flewed out last week when I went. <laughs> anyway, y'all. Um, I I'm ate my lote and it was good. I need to. It was all right. I need to eat my burrito tacos but because we driving around for gas i won't trying to spill that hot soup on my legs and we still here's the gas even faster i missed that all right y'all somebody tell us where the gas is are you crying because yeah. <laughs> i at least had a half a second and i thought i was gonna be I thought I was trying to be proactive and take my half to a full, but she said ding ding, ding ding, and so 18 miles is all I got, so. So we can only go 18 miles. If y'all ever drive past me in this outfit holding my burrito tacos, it's because we ran out of gas. Oh, baby, never, never. We'll be calling triple A. They gonna come give us a gallon. We don't need all that gas. They'll How they gonna get us a gallon? gallon? They got triple A gas on reserve. Yeah, they keep gas in the gas um in the trucks. That's how you can call you call triple A for a flat tire. You need gas. You need a jump. You need a battery. They got all that on the truck. Okay, it's well worth the investing. Well, it. while we waiting on triple A, I'm gonna be oh, eating my burrito right. tacos. Anyway, triple A. Yep, we just still riding around town, y'all. So hopefully this will all be over real soon, and it's just a phase. Right? It's just a phase. Just a phase. Right, mm -hmm. right. Okay. Well, whenever we stop, I'll attempt to try and eat these burrito tacos if they're not cold. Um, but all right. Okay, y'all, update. We have been to like eight or 10 gas stations. We stood in line in one gas station got to the entrance to get ready to go to the pump and it was like no gas so that was all the way in raleigh we drove all the way back home to durham and we finally came and got some gas at the harris teeter so thank the lord we got some gas we're not gonna be like the rest of these people and be trying to fill all the way up or whatever we just gonna get enough so that we can last through the rest of the week and then hopefully this mess will be over um and then also second update my burrito tacos were good honey i was not finna record we was in line for forever looking for gas and i just <laughs> over it but that was good um so we're about to get this gas we're about to go home because people cutting up outside trying to look for gas um and then i'll let y'all know how my mom and my sister like their nachos if they're not cold already because we ain't made it back home yet and then um i'll score and rate the food from um queso macho queso monster yeah oh no okay y'all update so my mom just put her card in she's trying to get gas and it says like 19 cent it's going slow like it's not working uh oh y'all i think they're out of gas y'all we finally make it to a pump and i think they're out of gas It literally says she got 21 cents of gas. 21 cents of gas, y'all. You got me beat. I think we're done. Oh no. I think they ran out of gas, y'all. Ain't this a mess? Okay, y'all. Upgrade. Uh, upgrade. <laughs> Update. They was out of 89, which is what my mom uses. She uses 89 grade gas. So she had to stop her pump her pump cancel it and then go and get 85 no 87 what no my mom uses 87 and she had to stop the pump to get 85 whatever y'all know what i'm talking about she got she had to get the low grade gas that she not used to getting in her truck because they ran out of the mid grade gas anyway like i said still a hot mess i can't wait to get home get out of this catastrophe because the sun is going down and i'm getting like restless or whatever and i just want to like go home because this has been a very chaotic day okay very chaotic looking for this gas 
hopefully y'all are not struggling like we are in North Carolina. But if you are, shout out to you, Boo. I hope you put gas in your cart already because if not, just don't go nowhere for the rest of the week. Just don't go nowhere. All right, y'all. We made it back home after getting all that gas. And I just wanted to give y'all an update on the actual food um, that we had at Queso Monster. So, ratings, my mom versus me. Um, my sister, she felt pretty okay with the food as well. Um, but just to go down the line, so we had the... I had the strawberry lemonade and I rated the strawberry lemonade a nine only because I like the balance of the sweet and the sour. My mom had the berry explosion lemonade. She rated hers at eight. She said it was really good, but the lemonade was a little um, too tart for her. Um, maybe it was the pomegranate that overwhelmed. I'm not sure. Um, when it came to the elotes, my mom just flat out gave it a zero. She said she didn't like it. She didn't like the combination. Um, me personally, I gave it a five because um, the combination of the um, cheese and the corn itself was okay, but I feel like it was missing salt. I've also had elotes like way better than that, um, especially compared to what I'm used to eating. Um, and when it came to my mom's food, she remember she had the veggie nachos with shrimp. Um, she rated it a seven and a half. Um, she thought it was pretty okay with the balance, but she wasn't like crazy about it compared to other nachos she had. Um, and then my case of burrito, I um, gave it a uh, eight because I've had burrito before. Um, the soup consistency was great. The flavors were there, but when it came to the queso, um, the cheese blend just didn't quite fit with what I thought. Um, what happened with the actual burrito itself in the quesadilla so overall it was a good place if you just want to go and try something new um or if you're just kind of like wanting to get like some mexican food is the place that i would recommend for you to go if you like know like you want some really 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 good mexican food um from off of a food truck um maybe not but overall i did enjoy um uh, for it being my first time um i'll probably go back but i would definitely try something different not what i had currently um so as always thank you guys for watching my video um i hope you enjoyed it please go ahead if you haven't already hit that subscribe button so you can see when i post more videos um and until next time great people stay safe out there and remember get your gas if you ain't already got it peace out